Let's get salty! Hey everyone, Zeddy here again today with a brand new video, and we have ourselves another cheating problem in Hearthstone. This time, it's not something in the past, it's something going on right now. It's happening in Wild. Um, we have had multiple players, multiple reports to Blizzard, adding play Hearthstone, uh, Exar, Celestial on multiple devs uh, for weeks now. And we have effectively got no response outside of one thing, which we'll talk about, uh, but no follow up, no confirmation of action, nothing, just kind of leaving players uh, in the blind right now. So I've waited long enough. I feel like that this is frustrating for a lot of people, especially at Higher Legend. Myself, I've even run into this incident um, off stream. I, I have a 10 star, 10 star multiplier. 10 stars, so I'm not playing it like high MMR. I was like diamond five and I ran into someone doing this to me. Um, so I can only imagine, I imagine other people are having this happen to them as well. Um, but yeah, it's implicating wild. It's literally against TOS as confirmed uh, by the dev comment. We'll talk about that again, but uh, what's going on? And basically uh, what's going on is people are abusing a bug or hacking their client or something with Ignite Mage, I'll highlight a list here. I don't know if it's what they're using, but whatever. It's the principle of it. Uh, you play Sorcerer's Apprentice, you copy it with a Molten Reflection and, well, instead of just showing screenshots, let's take a look at an example. So here we have an example. This is, uh, well, this was tweeted out on October 2nd. So just a couple of days ago, again, there were prior tweets. I think Hijo had one of the first ones from September 20th, uh, but this one shows it's a continuing problem. This is on the Chinese server. And uh, yeah, let's take a look at what's going on here. So um, you can see what happens, right? You, th there's an apprentice on the board, get the cauldron, you copy it, and then you start ripping through your deck. You'll notice I'll move my camera here. This clip is over two minutes long. Your turn, I believe, is supposed to be at max 60 or 90 seconds. Regardless, over two minutes long. And what they do is they manipulate the game or the coding or something where their timer never runs out. They just keep going. And this player for over two minutes just keeps going. Drawing cards, the animations keep going. It keeps going, it keeps going. You can see this is over, we're uh, now a minute 50 into the clip. The rope is nowhere to be found. And they basically could go infinite turn. They even complete their quest, could play the quest and keep going if their opponent had armor. So you can see how this is a little bit problematic. By the way, this is turn six, very healthy for the game. Exodia on turn six, infinite mana quest completion on turn six but yes the rope literally never appears it never appears and that's what's going on right now and uh people are abusing this and as alba pointed out here still waiting uh for this cheater ban as uh, again i mentioned i'll just go straight to hijo's tweet hijo's a top standard and wild player hijo's one of the best players i've ever faced Kicks my butt all the time. I get salty about it all the time. It's what I do. But Hijo's a really good player. He's been rank one legend in Wild and Standard multiple times. And he, uh, yeah, he reported like October, September 20th, mentioning it. Because he's playing Druid, playing with like 71 armor. And his opponent, Holy Crab, literally goes through his entire armor, killing him, which should not be possible. The animations take too long. The turns take too long. And they're actively cheating. And as Al pointed out on October 1st, this guy is now ranked 17 legend, still doing it. And apparently uh, even this comment here that he's openly admitting to doing it, but nothing has been done about it. The only comment we have received so far um, is Celestalon himself stating that hacking the client is absolutely against terms of service. That was on October 1st. Uh, people were asking, where are you gonna look into it? Can you ban him? Can you do something? Uh, there's other people doing it. It's against TOS, but so far nothing. And I don't feel like waiting around and waiting to see out of the goodness of their heart if they're gonna do something because they, they're they obviously watching these Twitter threads. Uh, Celestalon made the comment, you would think that they can at least say they'll investigate it something. Uh, from what I'm aware of, we have had no comment. Ixar has made zero comments about it. And yeah, I was asked on Twitter myself uh, today about it, um, how long you can ignore the mechanics, seeing how a player cheats to go to the top one. Because if you look on the EU leaderboards as of today, this guy is rank two legend, openly cheating, manipulating, skipping turns, all of that. And I know wild rankings don't mean what they mean in standard. They don't have HCT or not HCT, K 
can we have that system back? But uh, GM implications, but still, it's completely ruining the experience of the ladder. The ranking should at least mean something, and people are actively cheating. And uh, this has happened before. Uh, people skipped animation timing for Snip Snap Warlock and uh, resulted in people actually having their accounts banned. So I'm hoping Blizzard steps up, bans these people, do something about it. Maybe they just don't want to openly say anything. Maybe they are investigating. And if they are, that's great. And hopefully they are banned. But I wanted to put this out there, let people know. I'm not going to try and let anyone know how to do this because I don't even know how to do it. I don't even know how you would do this. I don't encourage trying to figure out how to because I do think, um, you know, with pressure from people like myself, people on Twitter, or just the internal processes of Blizzard themselves, there will probably be action going on. But again, I wanted to make people aware of what's going on try and put some pressure on in case they are doing this because if you don't ban this type of interaction if you don't ban this type of thing where does it stop right like wh what type of manipulations can you do it and i've heard the argument that shouldn't be capped by animation times and all that stuff anyways but this is even beyond that this is beyond animation times this is literally abusing the turn time limit which is a inherent rule in the game that you only have so much time so it's not even about abusing animations and not about that which again even that in itself is not okay but this is outright flagrant cheating in the game and should not be acceptable in and i think we're all triggered by ignite as not enough as it is so um hopefully something will be done about it hopefully something will be done soon about it but if not we'll probably make a follow-up video put some more pressure on and see what happens from there and the main thing i will leave off with as an argument as to why this is definitely not okay can you imagine if this was in standard right now? Imagine this bug was in standard. Imagine if something like this was in Battlegrounds where they could somehow manipulate their turn and make it so that somebody, you know, whatever, whatever in Battlegrounds, someone can manipulate a turn like this. If this happened in standard and wild, the outrage, the outcry that would happen and do you think it would stand for very long? Would it stand for weeks like it is right now? I think it would be hit pretty quickly. So I would love for Wild to be treated the same as the other formats, have players that are abusing mechanics be punished appropriately. And basically, if you're doing it swiftly, doing it quickly, uh, people will be a lot less tempted to try and take advantage of these things. Because, well, if you're not really having a perception of real punishment out there, um, people are going to do this more and more, even if they eventually get punished, because if it takes this long, they're just going to have fun for weeks, making everybody's experience more miserable. So I'd love for Blizzard to step up, get on this immediately. Don't let it sit for weeks and weeks and, you know, send a message and make sure that, you know, people you know, they see that message and don't want to try and replicate this anytime soon. So Blizzard, please take care of this. This is not cool. And uh, if you run into this on wild or whatever, screenshot it, video capture it, whatever, at the appropriate people, let them know that this isn't okay. And uh, hopefully it will get fixed soon. So if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Have a great day and stay salty, my friends. <laughs>